Hey all, Osmobile update for June 2nd. Getting stuff done, getting parts in, so I just figured I'd keep you guys up to date. Um, I found some rot down here, which is unfortunate. I'm not terribly surprised. New England car and all, but yeah, you can see it's pretty crunchy in there. So I'm going to have to replace the back to about here, and then a bunch of this corner has rust preparation so i'm probably going to rebuild this whole corner in a way that reduces its ability to rust and get rid of these gaps that are letting water in that kind of thing i have the outer rocker which is why i just hacked it right off that's down here to replace that but unfortunately the inner stuff i'm gonna to have to fabricate from scratch this reinforcement panel you can see is also pretty nasty but i'm gonna get it done i mean whatever i knew i was gonna to have to fix rust sooner or later i just happened to find it sooner rather than later also, I got my seatbelts in. These are from Custom Seatbelts from Seatbelt Planet. Hashtag not sponsored. Hashtag I wish I was sponsored because Jesus Christ, this is $800 of seatbelts. Um, but this is my custom jungle green belts with the starburst buckles. This is one of the middle belts. I have two of those. I have the two rear shoulder belts. And then I have my custom two belt set up with the special two-piece one with the tongue stud that is going to allow me to have the belt for the lap and then the other retractor is going to be up there to come down for the shoulder but be able to be mostly hidden so that's going to be fun to put in but i'm really happy about it they look really great over here continuing work ground down cleaned up basically this half i'll get the other half when i get the other fender off all in here, clean this up, um, getting that all done. I have where they, ah, oh, they're up here. These are all the various pieces I've taken off that have all been ground down, painted, in some cases bedlined to protect them where they're in the side the wheel well. I've got a few more hanging around that I still have to do, but making progress there. Had to rebuild the fender bracket because every single, three of the four nuts snapped and the other one was gnarly, so I just Removed them and welded new nuts in. Horns need to get redone. But here's my other exciting thing that showed up. I took these lids off earlier and didn't put them back on so I can show you. This is my paint. I decided I was going to order the paint now so that I could jam and do the backs of things and whatnot while I was in here. This is my mint green. This is the amazing grove green. The camera seems to be showing it more blue green. Trust me, it's a very pure green green i don't like blue green so i would be very against it if it showed up that way but no it's in reality it's a very pure dark green with a lovely subtle metallic in it um you can kind of see how much metallic is in paint when it's like that but yeah i'm over the moon about my paint this looks so good i don't know if this is going to be enough to do the car but it's going to be enough to do the jams and inners and whatnot and then if i have to get more paint for the outside whatever i have to get more paint so you know everything that's black that's going to be the grove green everything on the uh, not the roof but the lower body and the hood and everything that's white that's going to be the mint green the plan for the roof is that it's going to be a dark green pearl with a lace paint job in it but since i haven't bought that paint yet who knows that may change but yeah, that's where I am, getting stuff done. I'm kind of jumping around between projects when I have, depending on what I have energy for and what I have the focus for, what I feel like working on. We're still working on the seats. That got stalled out because our sewing machine couldn't handle the multiple pieces of vinyl when we got to actually assembling the seats. So we just bought a Singer 301 super heavy duty sewing machine. Um, so we're gonna get back to that as soon as possible. The seat belts are not a good match for the green because the seats are much darker, but the, my other option for the seatbelts was an olive drab. So I'd rather have the brighter green than an olive drab. But yeah, making progress, making things look better. Super excited, super having fun, super frustrating. All, you know, one big package. But yeah, we're getting things done. We're making progress. Car's going to look awesome. So that's it. Happy Pride Month, everybody, to all my queers and all my queer allies. And good night.